Hey folks, it's IOE Thrower back with more World of Tanks. As you can see, this is Mojo in the 4005, the Doom Box, the um, the Barn of Death. Otherwise, known as some other things that I can't mention on camera. Um, and um, so we're just gonna call it Doom Box because, well, obviously box, and anyone who meets it generally falls to their doom. This is, of course, a tier 10 game on Malinovka. And it's an encounter battle, so that means off the bat we're closer to the enemy than we would otherwise be. What? Why? No. No, 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 no. Leave him alone. Yes, he's an ass. Set to the team. Hey, look, he's armor. You know, some people are just dumb, and I don't understand. Like, this doesn't... Why would you... I, I mean, at this point, I guess you could try rolling backwards, but we're pretty sure I know what this guy is going to do. So, uh, he asks... Apparently not to be pushed, and so, yep, he's just going to attempt to get in our way again. This is, this is lovely. I, I can see why this guy is on our team, because he is going to continue to be an asset to the team, right? Well, I'm pretty sure Mojo is done. I'm pretty sure I know what's about to happen. Um, yeah, uh, I can't recommend that you guys do that for your games in, in the FE, I mean, there isn't many other options, uh, in my meme tanks, when assets try and do that to me, I will take the tracks off and then walk around them. But I mean, if they just if they decide that they are just gonna continue to do this forever, it gets annoying. Um, and I mean, sometimes the only way to deal with it is to exit out of a game. But uh, and the best part is, of course, as far as war gaming is concerned, Mojo is the one who needs to be punished for this because the other guy was doing nothing wrong, of course. He was just, you know, trying desperately to make sure that a teammate's day was as horrible as possible. But oh well. That being said and done, let's make his day as horrible as possible. That poor centurion thought that everything in the world was safe and fine and joyful. And he was going to aggress on the enemy team. He found a way through the enemy lines. He was going to attack... And then his tank was on fire, and his crew were all dead, and he was trying to figure out what 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 just happened. Okay, there's no need to shoot that guy. <laughs> just because the rest of the the first scorpion was, was, you know, an asset. That doesn't mean you need to shoot that guy. I'm, I'm not a fan of auto-aiming from this distance. 500 meters away, auto-aiming. Bad plan. Yeah. Um... <sighs> That shell does not travel as fast as, as the auto aim is going to want it to travel. Ooh, he's tracked. He was tracked. He's now taking severe damage. <sighs> Please don't auto aim this shot. You don't need to. And it ain't going to go anywhere near the target. It's a bad shot for hang on. 263? 263? Is that the side of an, that is the side of an STRB? Please don't auto aim the shot. Thank you. Holy smokes. Well, that guy died. <laughs> huh, huh, that happened. <laughs> That's some nice retribution there. Oh, that poor guy. <laughs> Tier 10, enemy tanks sure, was probably having a good game right up until he got spotted and he was showing his side to the <laughs> to the doom box 
and then suddenly he was not having a good game. Wow, that's unfortunate for him. Uh, our team is still losing though, so there's that. Um, our ELC is retreating, so he, he can't light anybody up. That's unfortunate. That is a side of a 2-6-3. Oh no, no, don't... Mm, fine. Oh, oh yes. Oh yeah, that was a beautiful shot. I mean, it, it did dip and, and curve off to the right. If it hadn't, it would have gone straight through and probably killed him. But as it, as it was... Oh, I guess it did about top damage. I was thinking of these going through people. Um, so it, it, uh, it dipped and took his tracks off. Oh, it was glorious. I enjoyed watching that connect. That was a lot of fun. Good job, by the way. Oh, hello, Mr. WZ. Please don't auto aim these shots. <laughs> that was good. I enjoyed that. That was good. Uh, I'm sure the ELC actually really enjoyed that, too, as... That was the thing that was about to kill him, and then it vanished from the map <laughs> in this mushroom cloud of awesomeness. Uh, there's a panther two over there as well, but I get the feeling he probably doesn't want to push any far over, as the last guy who peaked that ridge vanished from sight for several years. <laughs> was never seen again. <laughs> oh! Oh no, the panther does want to push this rise, apparently. The panther didn't realize the extent of the badness that happened to the last guy. And so he was like, I can do it! No, no you can't! <laughs> and they never found his body. Oh, that was good. So now, there is still a 263. It's, it's the same 2 6 we shot earlier. So he's crippled. And and basically in a pile somewhere going, Please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me. Um, and, uh, and now our Scorpion G is going to go scout. Good. Bad. Apparently he managed to get killed without getting lit. Uh, which is kind of special considering where he was. Um, if the... If you killed him down here... I guess here, that gang lit. It's possible he's on this rise, but it's, I think it's more likely he's over here somewhere, um, back behind bushes. Um, so that's it, interesting and kind of an issue. Um, now, technically, we have a mouse. Oh, is he literally up there inside uh, the T32 doing doing uh, damage up there? Is that what I see? Is I see a shrimp uh, like a, a now let's pull this mini map up. Let's, yeah, okay, so. So the moss is up there killing a poor T32 who's got no chance against the moss, by the way. Yeah, right? Um. And then. So now. I think these two are going to try and circle. Oh, there's the 263. And they're both up there. Well, that means we can move, obviously. Uh, we're going to speed this up because if those two are up there. And there's absolutely no threat to us zipping across the landscape and starting this cap. Yep, yeah, that is in fact what we're going to do. As the team finishes off the last of the enemies. <laughs> uh, I gotta say, this game didn't start out looking all that great. But boy, did it end nicely. Um, and all the way through, I mean... I'm never going to encourage you guys to go ahead and kill your teammates. No matter how much of an asset they're being. However, um, I don't really see any other solution at this particular circumstance. Third class Master Badge, uh, Bruiser, High Caliber, and the, the, um, or sorry, Bruiser, Fire for Effect, and the High Caliber. This was well done. Oh, what do you mean there's not a high caliber there? Well, that's because of this. Um, but we all know he got high caliber in this game. Actually, he didn't. He was second highest in the game. Vegetto got would have got high caliber, but somehow didn't.
Does knowing a high cover in this game, game on our team? That's very interesting. Interesting. I, I know the handout too. One per side, so I guess we just didn't do enough damage. Huh. Weird. But okay. Um, either way, this was a great game. And um, this particular guy is going to end up on my blacklist. And I recommend everybody else out there blacklist him. Because obviously, he's a player nobody really wants to communicate with ever. And if you see him coming on the battlefield, you're going to want to have some warning. If he's on your blacklist, at least you'll get that warning. At least the penalties aren't too steep over here. They are unfortunately pretty steep over here, though, for uh, doing something that I, you know, I don't see any other way out of it, personally. But uh, great game, and uh, just just south of 5,000 damage done. Completely worth it. Oh, uh, how much did he do to... Oh, he just took the tracks off that 263. I, I thought he had, he had done a whole lot more to it than just take the tracks off. But oh well. Um, thank you so much for saying this in. Mojo, uh, it, I want to know how everyone else deals with this kind of situation. How, how, what would you do in this situation? I know what I would do, but what would you do? And so, yeah. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day. This IOE throughout.